Good afternoon. Our summit on the 23rd of October is challenged to decide on a comprehensive and a lasting solution to the crisis in the Eurozone. After my meeting with President von uh, Rompuy, I can assure you that we're moving forward to meet this challenge. And this comprehensive package will include issues such as the need for deeper economic cooperation, integration, and governance, the strengthening of the EFSF, and the strengthening of the European banking system. A crucial element is to make the necessary decisions concerning Greece, building on our recent summit conclusions of July 21st. We need to ensure confidence and calm in the markets. We need to lead to sustainable growth and investment because Greece has great potential, but this potential has in the past been mismanaged. That's why we're moving ahead with major reforms, radical changes that we are implementing throughout the Greek economy and in the public administration to guarantee competitiveness, productivity, growth, transparency, and social justice. In this respect, the recent statement uh, by institutional partners shows the positive momentum that we have achieved. As I have told President von Rompuy, it is the Greek people that want change. They want, we want change in Greece. And however painful, we are committed to make these changes in the best interests of the Greek people, defending their right for a better future, a more prosperous and just future. Again, we are all now aware that we also must tackle flaws in the design of the Eurozone, the institutional design. So I'd like to add my voice to those who believe in a deeper and stronger Europe, such as the 96 personalities that only yesterday called for a European solution. This is the task, but I'm more optimistic that there is a new will to live up to this challenge, this common challenge for Europe. So I believe we can make this crisis an opportunity for success, for success both in Greece and in Europe. Thank you very much.